Video Diary 1. There are missing posters all over the walls. There was even a new segment featuring her. She's gone missing for a month now, and people are starting to lose hope. I don't want you to think that I'm like a creep or a stalker or whatever. I'm an investigative journalist, well aspiring. And this case, the case of Rory Tyler, is going to be a special one. And I'm going to find out what happened to her, and this case will be my big break. Though this be madness, there be method in it. I love that quote. Okay, so we're going to start our next journalism assignment. Okay, we're about to start our next journalism project. In light of recent events in our community, I've decided to focus on investigative journalism as opposed to the photojournalism we were focused on earlier this year. Your next assignment is to report a crime from the past. You're going to retell the case as if you were there while it happened and as if you were able to interview all the parties involved. Due dates will vary, pick your partners, and at the end of the assignment, you'll all present and let us know what you found out. My God, this is so stupid. And we have to solve a crime that was already solved. You know what we should be solving? What these two freaks do in their free time. <laughs> I don't even want to know. I hate him. What are you doing, Georgia? I'm getting my big break. Care to elaborate? Rory Tyler, I'm going to find her. Um, didn't Miss Jackson say to do past cases? Like, ones already solved? Stephen's right. Excuse me? Could you repeat that? Because I think I just heard you say Stephen's right. No, he is. Listen, why should we waste our time and brilliance looking at old cases when we should be looking at real ones, the ones people are actually interested in? Okay, but why Rory's case? I mean, she's still missing. Miss Jackson isn't gonna let us do this. And besides, this is like real life, not some whodunit board game. Fine, then we'll do a different case for the project and then we'll do this case as a side project. Okay. Look, people already think that I'm crazy. I need to prove to them and myself that I can do this. Okay, but how do you expect to find her? I mean, my mom's a real detective and she hasn't found her. I'm an investigative journalist, or at least I'm going to be. Look, if I can solve this case, I know that I'm meant to do this forever. So, are you in? Do I even have the option of saying no? Well, you could sit at home for hours looking at a laptop, screen and old newspaper clippings, or you could come with me and create news. Mom's gonna kill me for this. Not if you help her solve a case that has her stumped. I mean, she might actually feel good solving a case for once, no offense. Okay, then fine, why not? You know, this could actually be kind of fun. I mean, it's like, illegal with the whole tampering with the police investigation thing, but who cares? I'm in. Great. Okay, so how are we gonna solve this? Where do we start? I have an idea. Am I gonna like it? Probably not. This is such a stupid idea. Come on, hurry up before someone sees us. You know my mom? She used to lock up all my toys because she was afraid that I'd choke if I ever played with them, with them while she wasn't watching me. But I used to break in and steal them. I think it had some long-term effects. You think? You've pretty much become a felon. Hamlet? What's Rory doing with a copy of Hamlet? You read it last year. It's a note! Written by Rory! Whoever she wrote it to, I guess they never got it. Hey! What are you kids doing? Are you trying to get a detention? Video Diary 1. 
Diary 2. The Rory case is a go. My best friend Alfie is helping me, thank God. He's had my back ever since he moved here a couple of weeks ago. You're sitting in the missing girl's seat. Oh. Oops. I feel kind of bad because he's getting the fall and taking the lunch attention for breaking into Rory's locker, but he'll get off easy because he's the DI's son. Besides, it was worth it. We found a clue. Well, no, it, it's not much, but I mean, it's definitely a clue. <laughs> Meet me near the park at 8 p.m. I can't wait to see you, Rory. Now, the question is, who could she be talking to? Oh my god. Steven! I, I saw him and Rory drive together all the time. I can't believe I never realized it before. They must have had a thing. I need to start there. Oh, this is going to be the best case yet. <laughs> that must be my dog. She's a crazy little thing. What are you doing here? Wait, so the note means she was seeing someone? Obviously. Okay, who do you think it is? I think it might have been Steven. Steven? But how can you be sure? I'm not, but uh, he's a good place to start. Let's go. <clears throat> what do you two want? Can we ask you some questions? About Rory. Go away. No, wait. Please? What are you to the police? What are you trying to hide? Who do you think you're talking to? I'll catch you later. Where were you the night Rory disappeared? I was at home. Really? On a Friday night? Not that I have to answer to you two. But I was at home watching my little brother while my parents weren't home. Did you talk to her at all that night? Yeah, during the school days. He liked my Insta posts, but that was the only interaction we had that day. Were you in a relationship with Rory? What? Answer the question. Okay, we talked a little, yes, but we never got together. She ended everything the day that it happened. So, the last time you saw her, she broke up with you? And now she's missing. I know what you're thinking. I didn't do anything. I wasn't even with her that night. I have proof. I'm at home, see? He checks out. You guys are just freaks. Do us all a favor and stop putting your noses in other people's businesses. You're gonna ruin it for everyone else. What's that supposed to mean? Video Diary 3. Well, Steven checks out. I mean, I thought for sure he knows something. Okay, so if the note wasn't for him, then who was it for? He's just so shady all the time. I don't understand. Okay, so Friday night, Rory leaves, goes to the park on Hannigan Road, and suddenly disappears. How does she do it? This case is going to be harder than I thought. Projects are coming along. Fine. Okay, what do we do now? We need more evidence. And how are we gonna get more evidence? I mean, we already salvaged everything there is to salvage from her locker. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Break into my mom's office? Oh, come on. I was kidding, Georgia. Are we seriously? Did you have any idea how much trouble we could get into if we get caught? But we're not going to get caught, are we? Oh my god, this is so stupid, Georgia. Oh, come on, Alfie. This might be my only chance of getting my big break, and I can't quit now. Please? Okay, fine. But you had better have a backup plan in case this whole thing goes south. Of course I will. I'm not stupid. 
just go in and tell the person at the front desk that you're bringing your mom lunch or something. Okay. What do I bring? Salad or french fries? You're not actually bringing her lunch, dumbass. Oh. Oh, right. I'll be on the lookout. You go in and grab the file, and let's get out of here. My mom's very organized. Uh, why are we staring furiously at Chloe? I saw her at the police station yesterday. She was talking to one of the detectives. She looks scared. I'm not following. She was Rory's best friend. Maybe she knows something and she's not telling anyone. She did become Miss Popular overnight once Rory went missing. Maybe she's not scared. Maybe she's hiding something. Well, there's only one way to find out. Uh, last time I checked, we weren't friends, so I don't think I have to answer any questions. And I'm pretty sure that's gonna leave a bruise. Yeah, but you were friends with Rory. Best friends. So? So Rory was supposed to meet someone that night and never did. Was that person you? How did you know that? <gasps> so it was you. Uh, maybe it was. What's it to you? Well, if you weren't with Rory, then where were you? Not that it's any of your concern, but I was with a friend. Really? You were with Stephen. Uh, what? I didn't say that. You didn't want Rory to know you were seeing her boyfriend. Oh, shit. Uh, fine. I liked him way more than she did. She only dated him to piss me off. Some friend, huh? Man, what a crappy friend. I know. I swear, if any of you two freaks tell, I will ruin you both. Noted. Something's not adding up. It's gone. The entire file is gone. I've checked everywhere. No, there's no possible way anyone could have gotten in here unless they're let in. I'm sure. I don't know. All I know is whoever stole the file must have taken Rory. I want to get to the cafeteria. It's taco day. No time for tacos. We have a file to sort through. <sighs> so her file says they couldn't find her phone anywhere near where she was last seen. She left her house at around 7.30 and went to the park on Hannigan. Her parents reported that she didn't seem distressed or acting out of the norm. There isn't any reported family drama or self-harm. So that means she couldn't have run away from home. So does that mean somebody took her? Maybe. They have two CCTV pictures of her from that night. 
Let me see those. Now we know what she's wearing. I remember this outfit. She wore it to school. Wasn't she wearing a sweater though? In the picture, she's not. So she took off her sweater? Why, why is that important? It was the coldest night of the month that night. It doesn't make any sense why she would take off her sweater. So whoever has the sweater has Rory too. We need to find that sweater. Where are we even supposed to find this sweater? It's impossible. Maybe right here. Is that seriously it? I'm pretty sure, and I think I would remember it was a pretty cute outfit. Um, hi. Hi, can we ask you some questions? Uh, excuse my friend, she's just very eager. Um, sure, what's up? Where'd you get that sweater? Um, Rory gave it to me. Uh, Georgia just likes to keep up on all the fashion trends. Rory gave it to you? Um, about a month ago. A month ago? Rory went missing a month ago. Well, it was before that. No offense, but why would Rory give you a sweater? You guys weren't even friends. No, she told me she had two of the same pair, and she gave me one. She said anything, including this ugly-ass sweater, would make even your wardrobe look better. She's such a bitch. Oh, that makes more sense. I beg your pardon? I just meant it didn't make sense why a girl like Rory would be talking to someone like you. Uh, someone like me? What does that even mean? Uh, well, it, it, I just meant that, you know, you're not popular or liked for that matter, so... I mean, come on. Everybody knows you had it out for Rory for, like, ever. Asshole. She stole my boyfriend and has made my life a living hell ever since freshman year. So you followed her to the park and hurt her. It was you. No, it wasn't. I didn't do anything. And I don't have to answer to you. How can we be sure? You know what? I wish it was me. So I could have seen her suffer the way she made me every single day. Yeah, cause that wasn't suspicious. Still doesn't explain who she went to meet that day. Georgia, did you hear Trish? She obviously did it. I just think we need to keep looking, just to be sure. Okay, well if she hated her so much, then why did she wear her sweater? Every girl wanted to be like Rory. Diary 4, The Missing Sweater. We know Rory had a sweater, but in the picture she wasn't wearing one. So who has it? Now that we have the file, I think we're finally going to be able to solve this case. I'm finally going to get my big break. Now, I just need to double up on our situation. Someone's hungry again. She's always ruining my video diaries. Where'd everybody go? That's weird. Where are you going? My mom wants me to be home. We have to take my dog to the vet. But you stay here, see if you can find something. Uh, okay. Mom, what's going on? Don't worry about it. This is official business. What? Stephen Canterbury? Yeah? You're going to have to come down to the station with me for questioning. Why? Stephen, just come with us. 
Just come with us to the station. Uh, what? He didn't do anything! We found Rory's stolen file in your car. Alfie, will you please stop pacing? It's getting annoying. I'm sorry, it's just... We were so close to figuring it all out just for the police to find out it was Steven the whole time. <laughs> Whoa, it's almost like you cared about this more than I did. Who's supposed to be the aspiring investigative journalist here? This isn't funny, Georgia. I thought you of all people would, you know, understand. I mean, this is your big break. It was, and I'm going to get mine. This just wasn't it. How did Stephen even get the file? I mean, I, I thought we had the file. Maybe they had copies. Why are you being so weird? That stupid dog! I swear, one of these days we're just going to get rid of her! What a crappy friend. I know. So whoever has the sweater has Rory too. Every girl wanted to be like Rory. All I know is whoever stole the file must have taken Rory. Must have taken Rory. Must have taken Rory. Must have taken Rory. Oh my god. What are you doing? It was you. What are you talking about? Where did you get that? You don't have a dog, do you? Get up. Why do you have Rory's necklace and sweater? Shut up! It was you. You planted the file in, in Stephen's car. What was the point of all this? I said shut up. I didn't kill her. She's still alive. Not for long, though. You're, you're crazy. I will do whatever it takes to get my big break. By committing murder? Solving my own case. The perfect crime. It has a nice ring to it, don't you think? What? I know what happens from start to finish. No one suspects the narrator. We lead you to believe what we want you to believe. It's genius. And you know, in the first week, people are concerned. And by the second, people start to dwindle. And by the third, no one cares anymore. Besides, no one liked her anyway. I'm going to call the cops. I can't let you do that. Not when I'm so close. So close to what? My big break. No, Georgia, stop! Georgia, please! Go! Me. Please! Georgia, stop! Please, stop! Please. Stop! stop. <laughs> okay, Georgia, your presentation is up. Well, I know the assignment was to present a case from the past, and me and Alfie did, but um, in light of recent events, I decided to present the case that I helped the police force solve, if that's all right. Well, considering your partner was arrested, sure, go ahead. I mean, you did help solve the case. You know, it was your big break. I just hope I don't get fired for this. 
Well, in helping the police force solve the case, I made these video diaries in order to help. Video Diary 1. The Case of Bailey Reynolds. <laughs>